Hey y'all, back with another DIY tutorial. I am making a center table for my Barbie doll house for in the living room. And what you'll need is boxes. I had went to Walmart and got these. These actually left over from my kitchen. So I do have something left over. I like to use all of my leftover items. I went to Walmart and they're jewelry boxes. You can find this in the craft section. I do not remember the price. Um... So I may, won't be able to help you there, but it was not a lot. I promise you it was not a lot. So what I went on and did was only use three because it's the length that I want it to be. I just glued it on top of each other. I just glued it on top of each other. So your top will be able to come off. And your bottom will be able to come off. Now I'm using boxes because I like the dimension that it gives in here. I like this. And again, it's just leftovers. I didn't need it, so it's a little glue on there. I'm just going to turn that backwards inside of my dollhouse so you do not even see it. So you'll need boxes. You will need a mirror. I got this out of my dollar store. Hey, y'all, y'all see me? I got this from the dollar store. You will need a mirror. And all we're going to do is glue it on top. That's all. Of course, you need a glue gun and a glue stick. So some glue on top of the mirror do I want a diagonal you can style this however you want um I don't know y'all all right I'm gonna go regular just gonna place it on top and if I want to angle it I'm just gonna turn it like that all right so again your top will come off like this and it's come off like this because you can store stuff inside of here. If you wish to put some Barbie stuff in there, it's up to you. The middle will not come off because it's glue. Oh, it do come off. Okay. So you got storage spaces. That's creative. Okay. So all of them come off. That's your mirror. You will take Windex and wipe it off. Set that aside. Again, Dollar Tree. These were a dollar. You will need those. Leftover ribbon. I told y'all I like to use everything. These was leftover from my sofa. This is optional. You don't have to do this, but because I do have some leftover, I am going to use it. Tea lights. At your dollar store, four dollar. It do come on and off. Gives a warm feel. It's kind of cool. You'll just give it a nice wipe down, put this in there, and there's your tall lamps. So with the leftover I have, I'm not going to glue it on. I'm just going to wrap it just like that, give it a little bling. And if this is what y'all want to do, they got bling right in the dollar store. And I'm just going to sit it in there, just like that. And that's how you create a lamp for your dollhouse and a side table. I'm going to go ahead and do a video on this and show you guys how it looks. If you are not subscribed to my channel, please go do so right away. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at underscore art ands. I will leave a link on how to find me. If you have not watched all of my YouTube videos, please go do so. Tell me what it is that you think. If it's something that you wish for me to do, just comment and I'll be sure to get it done. I kind of ran out right here. So I'm just going to place that against the wall so you don't even see it. Oh, I might have some laying around somewhere. But this is the finishing product of DIY crystal lamps for your burrito house and an end table with storage. Thanks for watching, guys. Okay, y'all, this is the finishing look. So I decided not to do the ribbon bling only because it will be directly next to the sofa. I felt like that was just doing too much. And I did find an extra one. Well, I didn't find. I have multiple of these candle holders. They're actually for my wedding. 
So I just went on and placed them in here for a soft candle feel. Um, the table is over there. I didn't customize her yet, y'all. All my dolls are custom made. Um, I didn't make them, but I made them into looking like realistical people. They are all custom made. Oh, she's still crying. <laughs> so I didn't fix her up yet. I just added a hat. I will make her an outfit. This is the table. I found these little product, um, products at Hobby Lobby in the doll section. I did went on and added some of those handles because I had some left over from my zinc that I did. Sorry, y'all. My hands is in the dollhouse. It's kind of tiny in there. So, this is the zinc that I did. If you need a tutorial on how to do that, please just leave it in the comments. Let me know. This light don't belong there. It's just sitting there. But my whole dollhouse is custom made. And it's completely finished. I just need to finish adding pictures and finish the wall puzzle over there. And yes, y'all, if you do like this tutorial, please like, comment, and subscribe and tell me what it is that you think I should put in here or if I'm complete. Because I don't know. I'm always adding stuff. But this is the finishing product, y'all. Please share and let people know I have a channel. I'm just starting out. I hope you guys like it.